Alexander Pope once said, a little knowledge is a dangerous thing. It has been observed that the absence of visibility and clarity in career path leads to frustration and demotivation, due to which many a time job seekers don't even try to get a job in their desired field. If you browse through the internet, I bet nobody tells you about the career ladder that exists in the biotech sector and how you can progress. Today, we will be giving you a brief idea on how a biotech career ladder looks like once you get into a company, specifically the research and development sector, and how you can sail through it successfully. A career ladder is like a roadmap which motivates you and gives a direction to your career. Number 1. Junior Research Assistant A junior research assistant is an entry-level position to start within the biotech industry. Most of the biotech companies prefer hiring freshers for this post who are well-versed in hands-on lab techniques and have some amount of experience in the form of an internship during studies. If you are a CSIR net or GATE or DBT or ICMR qualified candidate, it will be an add-on. The job responsibilities, educational requirement and average salary are as follows. Number 2. Senior Research Associate A junior research assistant or a postgraduate can be promoted to this level after a considerate amount of experience in the required field. This profile is apt for a PhD freshers who are seeking to get into the research industry. The job responsibilities, educational requirement and average salary are as follows. Number 3. Assistant Research Associate Aside from performing various complex tests and experiments, the Assistant Research Associate is responsible for overseeing different operations within the laboratory. The job responsibilities, educational requirement and average salary are as follows. Number 4. Associate Scientist The Associate Scientist performs in close coordination with the junior level research associates and is responsible for overseeing research and laboratory operations within the department. The job responsibilities, educational requirement and average salary are as follows. Number 5. Research Scientist Almost every biotech and life science professional who is willing to make a career in research wants to be a research scientist, not knowing the fact that it requires a well-lit background in ground research. Job responsibilities of a research scientist are very crucial. The job responsibilities, educational requirement and average salary are as follows. After a research scientist, you can become a lead scientist. The most crucial job role of the lead scientist is to routinely manage large and multi-technique R&D projects, navigation of the regulatory framework and providing technical leadership to meet the desired R&D project's objectives is also a key role. The job responsibilities, educational requirement and average salary are as follows.
principal scientist. Job responsibilities of a principal scientist may vary with the work profile and the company, but the prime role remains the same, that is to coordinate the actions of all the teams, to train new generation researchers, to compile performance reviews, and to act as a source of knowledge in the laboratory. The job responsibilities, educational requirement and average salary are as follows. Chief Scientist Chief Scientist is one of the highest position in R&D sector. Being a Chief Scientist, you are part of the policy and decision-making board of the company. It requires you to develop a budget, manage different departments within the company and coordinate with various research members across all departments. The job responsibilities, educational requirement and average salary are as follows. Remember one thing at this juncture of your career, everybody will say get a job, but only a fraction will say go follow your dream and will guide you through. Biotechnica is here to help you at every aspect of your career. Feel free to comment below if you have any feedback or need any assistance. We will be happy to help. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon.